The Office 365 homepage is a nice jumping off point, but Office 365 is really about using the Office applications you already count on. Like most people, Allison starts her day by checking email. Here's her inbox and outlook. Working with email is no easy task these days. We're all flooded with email and are often communicating with people whom we have never met. With Exchange and Outlook 2010, you have powerful new tools for managing email communications. Allison spends most of her day in Outlook, the familiar email experience that millions of users around the world know and love. She has email organized in her own personal way with folders and mail rules. Here's a long email thread. Allison can make this much easier to manage by viewing it in Conversation View. Allison loves the custom quick steps she can create to manage her email more efficiently. She also has her calendar color-coded to help her identify different types of meetings, and she can see multiple calendars at once, even team calendars she subscribes to from SharePoint Online. With Office 365, Allison gets a consistent experience of her Outlook email, calendar, and contacts, whether on her PC, in her browser, or her phone. Here is the same Outlook inbox in her browser. She doesn't have to learn a new interface. Everything is right here, even IM and Presence. She has all the same folders, rich formatting and messages is retained, flags are retained, and she can even right-click and use a context menu similar to working in Outlook on the PC. With Office 365, Outlook becomes much more than email. Link Communications Technology and SharePoint Team Site enable Allison to connect with people and information in new ways. Now, rather than sending documents as attachments, her colleagues send links to documents stored on SharePoint, so everyone can be assured they're working with the latest version. Outlook becomes more personalized with photos of colleagues pulled from their personal profiles in Office 365. She can also see their online availability light up next to their names. If she hovers over a name, she will get a contact card that enables her to easily see the person's latest status, as well as easily initiate an IM or voice and video call.